now for three perspectives on the next few days. It is my great pleasure to introduce Helene Granqvist, President of Women in Film and Television International, who will be followed by Anna Serner, CEO of the Swedish Film Institute, and by Maria Jansson, who is a professor at Örebro, Örebro University here in Sweden. Take it away, Helene. Hi everyone and welcome to CALA 2020. I'm the president of Women in Film and Television International. It's an organization that spans six continents, about 50 member chapters. We collective, coll collectively work for change, inclusion and diversity in the industry. WIFTI runs program like 10% for 50-50. It's a rebate system for gender balanced productions. You can find more information about that on our website, wifti.net. We have three pillars. One is connection, and our mission is to connect our members all over the world. Another is knowledge. Our work focuses on sharing knowledge, experiences, and industry information and visibility to make women visible in front and behind the camera. To bring those pillars alive, we created CALA 2020. I believe that change happens when people start to really listen to each other. Change happens when those in position of structural power step aside and give way to marginalized voices. And change happens when we accept that there, is, that there is a problem and dare to work for a solution. Change happens when we reject the structures that doesn't serve us. My hope with CALA 2020 is to create a space where we can hear each other, see each other and connect with each other. Over the next few days, we're proud to be able to present incredible speakers, some of the leading creatives, researchers, executives, and activists in the world, coming together for powerful conversations on intersectionality, representation, intimacy, and the power of solidarity. We are also offering opportunities to meet, talk, and to get to know each other from all over the world, across the industry, and I'm hoping that we learn a lot from each other this weekend and that we'll create lasting connections. Our industry has the power to change the world and together we will be able to shape the sustainable future. Welcome to Carla. Oh, uh, I will announce my rock star, Sweden's own Anna Sanner from the Swedish Film Institute. Thank you, Helen. And I'm so happy and I'm so thrilled to be here. Uh, despite all May technical errors that we will be going through this weekend, it's so amazing that you have been able to achieve this digital platform for every one of us to be part of. When I started my work 10 years ago at the Swedish film industry, I never dreamed about seeing a conference like Carla 2020 actually taking place in Sweden, in the small place of Kalskrona, uh, but with participants and money from all over the world. I've always said as a mantra to myself, uh, to get myself going, uh, that stop talk and start to act. And you have all acted in so many different ways. And I'm so actually emotional that we can share the knowledge of every action, action in the whole world. The other thing I usually say is that money talks. And Carla 2020, it, it's, it would have been really something very new if that would have happened 10 years ago with money from all over the world. You heard about all the sponsors. They come from Canada, they come from Yurimash, they come from Ireland and Sweden. And the money says, we want change. Money talks the, langu the language of change in this matter. And the ones to make change is all of us together. Not one, but every one of us going together by everything we have learned. We are working for change, for parity in the world. We are working everyone to have an 
equal right to our own voice, an equal right for every one of us to be part of this industry. And I'm very, very aware of our different privileges, where we come from in the world, how much money we have, how, what, a, what kind of structure our countries have provided us with, with the history. But as the value statement said, with our moderators so beautifully stating them, is that we ha have so much from the privileged part of the world to learn and to change. And we have a responsibility to listen and to learn. And if we can help and listen to each other, we can really make a change. There is so much power and knowledge in this platform that we will get to know when we are together during this weekend. So my hope and my strong belief is this conference will be the absolutely most a fantastic and successful conference ever because it touches on something that no one ever has done before and I'm so happy that we can be a founder and a part of it and to participate with it so I'm grateful to be here and I'm grateful that you are all here and let's just do this together after we listen to Maria Jansson who is the next introducer Hello, Carla 2020. I'm really touched by your, by your speech. So I work as a professor in gender studies at Örebro University in Sweden. And my research centers on how policy shapes women's conditions. And currently I'm working in a project which focuses on the film industry. I look at things like public funding, film financing, quotas, and how these aspects affect the everyday lives of women working in the film industry. To me, Carla 2020 constitutes a unique moment for women in the film industry and scholars to come together. Scholars from around the world will share the results from their studies this weekend. And women from the film industry from across the world will share their knowledge and experiences, and not least, their films. As a feminist scholar, I am dedicated to the idea that feminism, to quote Bell Hooks, is a movement to end sexist, sexist exploitation and oppression. Accordingly, as I use feminist theory in my work to understand and conceptualize policy and women's conditions, I believe that in a wider sense, my research is also part of this movement. However, from studying politics, I know that research results, statistics, or for that matter, experiences, will not lead to change on their own. No, in order to do so, they have to be politicized. And by that, I mean that they have to be framed as pointing to relevant and important political problems. They have to be tied to values that people are prepared to mobilize around. In short, they have to be used to spur actions of some kind. But this transformation from knowledge into action is not an easy endeavor. And it is certainly not on the job description of university professors or film workers. So for this to happen, we need to join forces, scholars and film workers, and for a moment, let go of our professions and become activists. So let us use this moment provided by Carla 2020 to master all of our resources and capacities to transform the research results, insights and experiences that we would share this weekend into relevant and important problems that we are prepared to act on. Let us take this movement provided by Carla 2020 to start a feminist movement, an international and inclusive movement a varied and complex movement, a vibrant movement filled with the hope for change. Thank you. Thank you so much, Maria, Anna and Helene. Uh, it was a pleasure to hear these perspectives. And yes, I think we shall indeed be activists. 